Hi everyone, it's Laura. So today I will be filming a do-it-yourself of these two items that I have been keeping an eye on. Uh, and it's the milk for Santa and the plate that says cookies for Santa. And so I'm going to try to do it myself. So I went to Dollar Tree trying to look for a plate and a glass container um, that I can use. And I did find these two, so I'll insert the pictures of what I found. Okay, so I found that red platter and the glass uh, container. Um, so I also went to Hobby Lobby to look for some chalk paint and I did find this one and I got it in white. I am using chalk paint because it dries faster. Now for the stickers, I did cut them in the vinyl cutter. Uh, if you don't have any Cricut or a vinyl cutter, you can use regular stickers. I did find some at Hobby Lobby and I'll insert some pictures of some that you can use as well. Okay guys, so the first step is to grab some nail polish uh, remover and use some to uh, put it all over the, the plate to rub off any oils and the vase as well. Okay guys, sorry, um, I didn't realize the camera wasn't recording. So, I did do the first coat of the white chalk paint. So I'm gonna do the second coat. Um, the reason why I chose chalk paint was because it dries much faster than the regular paint. Also because I think, hopefully, the stickers will stick better to this than um, on, an, on a um, glossy surface. So I will continue to apply this out of camera to save some time. Okay, so that is my second coat. So now I'll just wait till it dries. Meanwhile, the milk container is still drying. I see some of the excess paint start to drip, so I'm just keeping an eye on it and taking it off. Okay, so I did start to apply this. So that's how that looks. I'm really happy with that. And you can't change the color font or make any other um, uh, uh, like a tree or a snowflake or maybe like a decoration around the plate but I, I like it like this okay guys so it has dried and so I'm going to grab my sticker and try to peel this off hopefully it sticks fingers crossed So, I think there. And you have to press down, press down. So, when you peel it off, it sticks to the bottle and it comes off the the transfer paper so really press that in okay so gently start peeling it off
Yay. I'm really happy. Guys, I'm doing this for the first time as well. So I'm happy these are turning out really nice. I got these um, paper straws for my, my son's birthday back in July. And I have these. But these go very well with both colors. And I thought it would look nice like that. So that is it, guys. That's how that came out. So, I will be inserting a picture of how everything came out with a nice setup. Hey everyone, so I made this little setup for the end of this video. I mean, it's only October, but you know how it is for these videos on YouTube. You have to make them months before. So, that Santa Claus is from Target last year. And that Poisonetta placemat is from Dollar General, actually. And I just got it like two weeks ago. But the star of this is, of course, the milk for Santa bottle and the cookie for Santa plate. And I mean, you guys, I am so happy. Like, honestly, in real life, it looks, I don't know how it, how it looks on camera, but it looks much more expensive than what it costs to make. So I honestly recommend you guys to make these because these ring up for like more than like 30 or $40 in some places. And you guys, we we were able to make this for like less than ten dollars honestly like five dollars probably so thank you guys so much for watching and i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't thank you guys bye love you guys